Hello, everyone. We are going to talk about one thing you may not know about Katz. Katz is situated at Sarnath in Varanasi. It is founded in 1973 by then Indian Prime Minister <coughs> Nehru on the request of His Holiness the Dalai Lama. Previously, it is a part of Sanskrit University, but later emerged as, a, as an independent institution under the guidance of His Eminence, the Samdhan Rinpoche. After retiring, Samdhan Rinpoche from the director's post, Gishing Hao Samdhan took the charge of, ch charge of director. In 2008, it became university under his guidance. Our current VC is Professor Alan Shastri. The students of Kats are held from Himalaya ranges of India, Nepal, Bhutan, and occupied Tibet. We have one of the most famous Tibetan li library. There are still many things you may not know about Kats, so my friends are going to tell you about them. Thank you. Uh, one thing, not one thing, but something that you have to know about the Kats. <coughs> Actually, our university is located in the Sarnath. And, uh, it is a place where Lord Buddha first taught his uh, will of teachings, the Four Noble Truths. And now our university is located here in Sarnath with the blessings of his teaching. And studying a Buddhist philosophy in this university has a very unique taste and uh, with more details and more, uh, more reference. Our university is the only platform in this entire universe where you will find all the four Tibetan Buddhism sect as well as Pyrn, the very native and <coughs> primitive religion of Tibet within the single boundaries. Which means it provides us a very golden opportunity to study the Buddhist philosophy in various doctrine of every sect. And of course, we are very blessed and privileged to have many respected professors in this campus around us, who never refused to guide and teach us even after the academic session period and class period. And here we learn various subjects. In, in languages we have English, Tibetan, Sanskrit, and Hindi as well. And in philosophy we have Tibetan and Indian Buddhism philosophy. And we also have uh, um, optional subjects like, uh, such as like history, economics and political science and many others. And we also have a... <coughs> okay, so I'll conclude here and uh, Mr. Chinzilo will grab, all your, uh, grab your attentions and talk to you about um, the libraries. Hello guys. <laughs> uh, I'm going to tell about one thing you may know about may not know about cuts. Uh, I'm sure you, you guys very exciting to know about it. And uh, there is our Shantarakshita library, which is very uh, important and very kindness for not only uh, a student who recover uh, only academic studies, but it's also uh, considered uh, riches and and uh, riches and one of the best uh, library in whole India. And we have also uh, those digital facility, which is very very necessary uh, for uh, this mo modern uh, uh, mm, educationist. And also we have many, uh, many kind of, uh, many kind of uh, section in our library. So that is one of the very special thing in our uh, uh, class. So thank you.